Welcome Yellow Jackets to the Perrysburg Virtual Academy student tutorial. I will be showing you how to navigate the website on which you'll be learning. Notice in the upper left hand corner that it says Buzz which fits for us Yellow Jackets. We're going to click log in and you will need to log in with your username and password that you've been given. Notice before we click login, there is a tiny checkbox to log in as a parent. Parents, if you are checking your students' grades or checking out what your students are learning, um, instead of logging in as them, it's good if you check that box and instead log in as a parent. Let's go ahead and log in as a student. Okay, this is what the student app looks like on your device. And you can see, um, I'll call this the home screen. Um, you can see different tiles in the middle of the screen. And those are the courses that I am signed up for, the courses that I'm responsible for in my learning. It has today's date, as well as a little button here for announcements that would be lit up if I have any really important messages from my teacher. I always want to make sure that I check to see if there's anything there first before I learn for the day. Okay, you can see right here that we're in the courses view, but we also have a couple different views which we'll take a look at right now. Um, these tiles are for your courses, but if you hover over different areas of each one, you can see there's a quick way to check grades or the activities that need to be done, and you'll see a little progress bar to show you how far along you are. If you click to-do list, you'll see what's due. As you can see, there's several past due assignments. You'll see things like that. And you'll also see, most of the time, the uh, due dates for assignments that are up and coming. So you know what you need to do next. You can click on each one and go straight to that assignment and take care of it then. The activity screen shows you uh, any recent interactions with your coursework. Uh, for example, if a teacher grades something, you'll see what they've done recently as well as when they took care of it. If we continue to roll over here uh, where it says announcements and it says go to communication, this would be any messages from the Perrysburg teacher that's been assigned to you. Let's click the three lines in the upper left corner and go back home. A couple more things up here. One is the help window. If you're really struggling with something uh, in the app, you can uh, type in how to do something. Um, you can view a couple things here. Um, but if there's a question you just can't answer, please contact the Perrysburg teacher that's been assigned to you for help. And then lastly, if you click in the upper right hand corner, this is you. And you can change some settings, choose some theme colors so it looks different in the app. And you can also log out of the app if need be. Okay, so that's a little bit about how to navigate around. Let's take a quick look and see what a course looks like. So if I click on this uh, middle school life science class that I've been assigned to, all right, uh, now I can look and see activities. Well, activities is really everything that's in the course. And this will look similar for any course that you're taking. At the top here, it's going to show you the last thing that you did. So you can go back to it if you want to review, or you can go back to it if it's not quite finished. It'll also tell you what's up next, so what it is that you're going to be doing next in the course. The very first folder, right below the search bar here, in case you want to search something, uh, the very first folder is called Course Resources. If we click this little drop-down arrow, um, these are course guides that go with it. And sometimes in your course, there's just helpful things there, maybe for your parents to check out. Uh, what is Science is my first course folder. And I can see a little green check mark. That tells me I've already done lesson one. But let's click in that folder and see if there's anything else that needs done. Okay, I've already done the read it, the show it, all right, and the show it answer key. That's what the AK stands for. So I can actually go back and I can see that I'm ready to check out lesson two. Okay, there's a read it that I've not yet done yet because it's not lit up 
uh, but I've done the watch it and I also need to watch the lab safety video. So it's easy to see the things that you need to do for each lesson that you're working on. It shows you what progress you have. Let's go back to the home menu. All right, back to the beginning. Last thing I would like to show you is that if you don't like the arrangement of these courses, you can also click here to order the courses. And by moving them uh, up or down, you can change the view on the main home screen. So you can see our courses were rearranged just a little bit the way that we want them. That's it for the quick navigation uh, of your learning, and we wish you the best of luck. And again, if you need any help, please contact the Perrysburg teacher that's been assigned to you. Go Jackets!